Let me tell you something, Mean Gene. This is the Hawk Mania right now, man. And I'm here to tell you what you gotta do when them stalkers come for you. All right, yo, what's going on, man? Well, you, as you can see, uh, today is Friday. You know what I mean? I'm on the grind, as always. You know what I'm saying? I, I go go to go to work this morning, get off, come straight to the next job. That's how the T. That's how his TI's got to do it. You know what I mean? That's how his TI's got to do it. Remember, I told you. I told you my nut ass brother was in the bed all day. That nigga don't do something, do do shit right. Look at the white car just waiting on me. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. Go ahead. He won't play you go. He won't play you go. White car just waiting on me. Remember I told you that nigga don't do nothing right. Stay in the house all day, right? At my mom crib. He be in the crib all day. Soon, soon as I get back in the city, cause I was, I was um. I do the land, the landscaping work out, outside from where I'm at, right? At the white, white folk neighborhood, man. I'm trying to tell you. Y'all just don't know, man. These white, white people got fucking million dollar homes, man. It's just crazy. Let me hurry up. Let me hurry up and say what I got to say. But anyway, this nigga been in the crib all day, right? Because my other brother told me he in the crib all day. Look at this motherfucker like he trying to... They be act like they wanna they wanna tap your ass, you know what I'm saying? You know, when they get real close to you. They wanna ride. It's either somebody's either more around up front, driving slow, and then somebody else tailgating like a mug behind you. But anyway, this nigga been in the crib all day, right? Now I'm out here doing deliveries right now. Guess who ride past me? His nut ass. But he don't wanna get no real job now. He now he moving. No, where, where you going, buddy? Oh, somebody blinking the lights at me. Um you don't want to get no real job, but you a gang stalk, though. You a gang stalk. You ain't got no work ethic. That's all. That's what it is. Anybody, anybody can ride around and 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 scratch their nose at somebody or some dumbass shit. You know how they put on a red shirt. You know how these. You know how they get these dumbass people to do dumbass uh, rituals and routines. But anyway, the hell with that nigga. Um, I'm up there. You know what I'm saying doing landscaping, right? Million dollar homes, right? Now you know, you know, um, they had a hard time trying to do the uh the synchronizations today because because I was I was pretty much out there in the boondocks, you know what I'm saying, with, with the rich, the rich white folk. We talking big ass cribs, we talking a lot of land. You know what I mean? White these white folk living good. And they they had they they gang stalkers, but they ain't had that many gang stalkers because you know white people them rich white folk, they're not really home like that. So the ones, the ones that are home, I don't know what this car doing, the lights blinking. Like he want to get over. But you know, you know the um, you know the ones that are home, they came out with their dogs. They came out, they came out with their dogs and stuff, right? One lady came out with red socks on. You know what I mean? You know they're gonna do their their little dumb stuff. But the thing is, the thing is, right? They had to make sure that the boss man show up with red. Him, him, and um, also the other coworker, the female coworker that was doing the landscaping with us. You know what I'm saying? She had on all red and everything, and they used her to try to do the microwave and, and the microwave weapons and stuff. You know what I'm saying? But, but since it was hard for them to keep keep track with the synchronizations, because they was doing, they were still bringing red and white cars, mostly white cars. But it was, like I said, we out there in the boondocks, so it was really, really hard to do it. So what they was doing was they kept they kept sending helicopters. Helicopters kept flying over them. You know what I mean? I'm trying to tell you, it's just crazy, like, like the dedication when it comes to this game, yo. Like, they make sure that, you know, they stay consistent with it. You know what I mean? No matter where you at, you know what I'm saying? I can't wait till I go off grid, man, so I can see... What kind of tracking they gonna do then? Now, I mean, let me take this, let me make it right, cause it, I 
get there faster to where I'm going. But yo, man, I hope y'all keep y'all heads up, but it's just crazy. I'm trying to tell you, just wasting money. There's so much that we could do with this money that they that they that they got using me as a guinea pig, as a as a as a test, as a test dummy or a test subject. And it ain't just me, it's everybody. Every TI and also the, the gang stalkers as well. They just they just not aware of it. That's all. They thinking they're getting paid or whatever. I don't even think they're getting paid. I think they just dummies. You know what I'm saying? Because I know all my brother broke. They ain't got no money. They gang stalk all the time. Everybody out here, Chris still fucked up. You know what I mean? They ain't got no money. So it's like, y'all keep talking about these gang stalkers getting money. People leaving comments about fifty dollars an hour. Man, shut up. And prove prove it to me. Stop talking shit and, and, and show me a, a pay stub or something. Let me see a pay stub of a gang stalker getting a hundred grand a year or something. You know what I mean? But all that, all that rah rah, all that um, that gossip. Man, I don't believe that bullshit. You, these people are gang stalking to stay out of jail, or they gang stalking to, to, to keep their section eight or whatever. And then at the same time, you know, most of these people that's doing it is Democrats, and you already know the Democrats is broke, and they they take the hand out from the beast. Any any day because they don't got no damn sense. Not saying that the Republicans ain't doing it. Of course they are, but ain't nobody doing it like the damn um the damn fucking um Democrats because they sit all they sit home all day, smoke weed and drink forties. They ain't got nothing to do, so they full time gang stalkers. Those rich white folk, which is the Republicans, they got they got they got jobs. They got other things. They come out with their red shirt and the dog, but they got to go back in the house and her handle business. But when it comes to these poor, low light mother suckers, man, they ain't got nothing to do. They gang stalk all day because they low, they low lives, they losers, and they know they, they know they loser. They never, they never mount to nothing. They weak. They don't have no choice but to gang stalk. You see what I'm saying? So I gotta hurry drop this all. You know what I mean? Stay on your grind, ladies and gentlemen. To the real target, the target world out there. You gotta, you gotta, um. You know, you just got to uh, keep your head up. You know what I'm saying? Keep your head up, legs closed, eyes open. You know what I mean? At all times, y'all. So y'all y'all stay up, man. I'm, I'm going to stop this right now because I got to drop this food. I'm coming to I'm coming to the area. I don't know why. It's over here somewhere. I got to pull out my flashlight. Y'all be good. And don't gang stalk. Don't be a loser like these bots. Don't be a bot. I know this is a movie, but damn, pick a better role. Would you play in a movie to be a be a bot? Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to play a movie. I want to be the star. You know how that shit. Here I am. It's consequences when it comes to... <laughs> it's consequences, baby, when you want to be a star. Can I get a hell no there? Holla back, y'all. Gangstalk assimilation, baby. Techcom BN38416, assigned to protect you. You've been targeted for termination. 